Good morning, grade three. How are you? I hope you always fine. With you today, Miss Iman Mahmoud, with our new lesson is equivalent fraction. What is the meaning of equivalent fraction? Let's see these shapes to um, to understand what is the meaning of this uh, name or this address. The first shape, just one colored board. We write colored boards in numerator and all boards are denominator. All boards are two. So the first fraction is one over two. The second, the second shape, how many colored boards? Two colored boards, all boards are four. If we look at the two shapes, we will find that the two equal, the two boards, the, sh the two shaded boards are equal. So the two fractions are equal. One over two equals two over four. Let's use the number line to know equivalent fraction. The first, the first number line represent half, one over two. And the second one represent six. One over six, two over six, and so on. If we look at the number line, we will find this distance from zero to half is equal the distance from zero to three over six. So one over two or half equals three over six. Okay, let's see those uh, examples to understand the equivalent fraction. One over two equals four over what? One becomes four, number becomes greater. So we will make a multiplication. First, we must know if we multiply uh, the numerator by a number, we should multiply the denominator by the same number. One becomes four. One times what equals four? One times four. So we will make time four in the denominator. One times four equals four. Two times four equals eight. That means one over two equals four over eight. Let's see the next example. Two over three becomes what over nine? Don't find the number in the numerator. So look at the denominator. Three becomes nine. Three becomes greater. So we will make a times. Times what? Three times what equals nine? Three times three. We should make multiplication in the numerator also times three. Two times three equals six. So two, two divided by three equals six divided by nine. Let's see this example. Six becomes three. Six becomes smaller. So we will make a division. Six divided by what equals three? Six divided by two. So we will make division in the numer in the denominator also. Divided by two in the denominator. Twelve divided by two equals six. Six divided by 12 equals 3 divided by 6. Let's see the next example. 4 divided by 18 equals 2 divided by what? We will uh, add the numerator. 4 becomes 2. 4 becomes smaller. So we'll make division divided by what? 4 divided by what equals 2? 4 divided by 2 equals 2. So we should make divided by 2 in the denominator. 18 divided by 2 equals 9. So 4 divided by 18 equals 2 divided by 9. The last example, I want to know the equivalent fractions of half. We will make times by 2 to find uh, equivalent fraction and 3 and 4. We have finished our lesson today. Thank you for listening. See you in the next video. Goodbye. <laughs>